Now, psychedelics is actually a term that has been popular since the 1950s, but there have been several other terms that have been used that essentially mean the exact same thing. Uh, first, psychomimetics was preferred in the earliest days of LSD research. Psychomimetics. You see, researchers believed that LSD could be used to help them learn more about psychosis by inducing psychotic states in volunteer subjects using LSD. They believed that LSD could reliably mimic the experience of psychosis, but this term was later abandoned after discovering marked differences in psychedelic and psychotic experiences. Now, in the late 1970s, the term enfugion was preferred. This word literally translates to God within or generating God. This new name was at least partially in an attempt to escape the negative connotations that the term psychedelics had in the 1960s. Now, you may have heard of the term hallucinogen. This term has been mostly abandoned in academic communities because it suggests that the primary function of psychedelics is to produce hallucinations, but many psychologists recognize that there's a lot more happening than just hallucinations.